New at 6, a new specialty women's store opens up tonight at Ross Park Mall. It is another creation of a major Pittsburgh sporting goods retailer that is targeting specific consumer groups. Money editor John Delano has the story. Recently, Dick's Sporting Goods has branched out with standalone stores like Field and Stream. But now the Pittsburgh based company is targeting women in a new store called Chelsea Collective. Chelsea is a first of its kind women's fitness boutique um, that really fuses fitness and fashion together. Kate Boyce, vice president of women's athletic apparel, says Chelsea is open in just two locations. Tyson's Corner in Washington, D.C., and Ross Park Mall. As for the name? We're inspired by the Chelsea area of New York City with its high fashion and diversity. The store offers popular fitness clothing and accessories. We will offer brands that are she knows and loves, like Nike and Akalia by Carrie Underwood. But we're also going to offer her niche brands, like an Alala, Spiritual Gangster, and a Lorna Jane that aren't as easily accessible. And there's a treadmill in the fitting room to test out the comfort of athletic wear. And how about this? Where exactly are we? So we're at our bra bar. A bra bar? She has spoken to us loud and clear through all of our research. And the two pieces of equipment that are most important to her are her bras and her footwear. Besides all the sports bras, check out shoes that double for both workouts and leisure wear. Dick's Sporting Goods has always been known for its athletic wear. But Chelsea Collective is taking it a step beyond, from casual lifestyle wear to higher fashion. And athletic wear that's dressy is in growing demand. Oh, I'm always looking for um, comfortable exercise clothing that's, um, like you said, a little bit more fashionable than just a regular t shirt and, you know, spandex pants or shorts. Comfortable clothing, but it also looks cute. And Boyce says Chelsea Collective is for all women. So if you're in your 50s, are you welcome here? Absolutely. If you're overweight, welcome here? Absolutely. John Delano, KDKA TV News.